Hi, I'm John Lincoln with Ignite Visibility, and today I'm gonna to talk to you about how to do local lead generation. If you don't know what that means, it means generating customer inquiries inside of a specific city generally, or sometimes many, many, many cities um, throughout a specific county, region, state, country, et cetera. But local rankings and local lead generation and running ads locally has specific implications and there's it's really a, a very interesting, intricate field. So today I'm gonna to talk to you about what goes into local lead generation, how you can do it and how you can be successful for your business. Okay, so the first thing you wanna do for local lead generation is determine your personas. And what I mean by that is who is your actual customer in each of the local areas that you're trying to advertise to. This is really important because if you don't know who your customer or customers are, you have no way of doing the next step. Okay, so the next step is to determine where are these customers spending their time online? And it's gonna be different for every single industry. So once you know who your customers are in those areas, you wanna create a map of all the areas that they would be looking at within that location. Okay, so now you know that you've got your customers, you, you've created a map of the areas that they would be, and it's time to start building those profiles and making sure that you have a strong foundation. So in this step, you're gonna be thinking about a lot of stuff. Are they on Yelp? Are they on Google My Business? Are they on Bing Places? Are they on um, local web pages where a web page is getting ranked? Are there local directories that are specific to your business. For instance, if you were in auto, maybe there's an auto directory. If you're in dental, maybe there's a dental directory. If you're in weddings, there's a wedding directory. So once you know all these specific areas, that's gonna be really, really helpful. And you're gonna to wanna to make sure that you create profiles there and then fully fill them out and optimize each of those profiles for your business name. But in addition to that, you wanna optimize those profiles for a keyword that you wanna rank, especially the Google My Business page, which is a really, really important one because you can get that ranked for terms, you can do advertising to that specific page, and um, so, that, so that makes that one important. And then in addition to that, what ads are your customers looking at? Are they spending time on the new Facebook local app? And if that's the case, are you serving ads to them through Facebook? Are they spending time on Google? Are you serving Google AdWords ads? And you're gonna want to make sure that you outline each of these and create a strategy for each one. Okay, so once you've kind of got all these things set up and you've got your ads running and, and the foundation is in place, you wanna make sure you link from your website to each of your local profiles. When you do that, it's gonna make it so that your local profiles rank higher because it gives it weight from your website so that they rank higher. In addition to that, you're going to wanna to use a tool like Moz Local or Yext. And when you do this, it's going to create local listings that link to your website. And the more local listings that you have that are accurate, the more um, you have visibility and also the higher your Google My Business page is gonna rank. So all of this stuff plays together. Yes, you wanna start with those core areas, fully fill them out, get those strategies going there, but then as a second step, make sure you get your local listings going. Okay, so one really, really important part of having a great local lead generation strategy is the actual web page that you're gonna be driving people to locally. So if you have two or 10 or 20 different local businesses within a specific area, right? You're a brick and mortar. You wanna create a local web page for each one of those. And then on each one of those web pages, you want to make sure that you've optimized the URL, the title description, the heading one, the heading two tag, the copy. You're gonna to wanna to make sure you've optimized the images. You're gonna to wanna to make sure you've optimized the schema.org um, and make sure that that's local schema.org. The reviews, you wanna make sure you've embedded a map on those pages. You have a call to action on those pages. All of these things are very, very important to make it so that that local listing ranks well. And when I say optimize, I mean pick your top two to four terms that you want those pages to rank for and make sure those are worked into each of the elements that I just described. Okay, so at the end of the day, driving local leads or um, driving people to your local business is, is something that is very, very doable. 
Um, and it's, it's, you just need to know the specific strategies that go around it. You wanna have your main profiles fully filled out and fully optimized. You wanna have your additional profiles um, also ranked and, and, and linked to from your website. And you wanna make sure you get on niche sites that are ranking because those can also just send a lot of direct leads. It's very important you're advertising on Google locally. That's one of the best ways to drive leads. And it's very important that you're looking at things like Facebook, you know, with their store visit ads, um, as well as just their, their general advertising um, through the newsfeed around specific locations, because that's gonna allow you to, to also have success. And then you wanna make sure you have a great landing page that converts and on occasion you're doing some split testing there because if you can increase your conversion rate 10%, you're gonna be getting a lot more leads. Local lead generation is totally doable. This video gives you a pretty good outline to get started and if you have any more questions, make sure to ask in the comments and I'll be sure to get back to you. Thanks so much for watching and have a great day.